Hey folks, it's Robin Robbins here, founder of technologymarketingtoolkit.com. I'm here with Colin Knox, who is CEO of MSP Gradient. And we're going to be talking about how MSPs are losing 10 to 20% of their net because they're simply not billing their customers for the services and the software and the things that they're providing. So Colin, great to have you here. Um, I know a lot of people already know you, but for the rare few who may have never heard of you and your company, give us a quick... Uh, 30 second thumbnail of what you do. Yeah, absolutely. Been been an MSP before, built a channel vendor before, know all the struggles both sides face. Uh, what we're doing at Gradient starting out is just eliminating all of the complexity and frustration with billing clients accurately for everything you're selling and delivering to them. Okay. Yeah. And it was kind of surprising to me because you and I were talking prior to the video, um, according to polls that we've done through our our membership, about 76% of MSPs feel like they are correctly billing their customers for their services, meaning that they're billing them for all the software, all the solutions, all the services, everything. Um, I, I think I will disagree with that, um, you know, because I, I do see, uh, number one, there's a ton of complexity in making sure every Every everything is accounted for yeah. in, in for the MSPs, and I know from working with a lot of MSPs, one that often when we get them to be a little bit more disciplined with their books and their finances and stuff, it's not uncommon for us to find that they are not billing for ten to twenty percent of the things they should be billing for, or they're getting their invoices wrong, which frustrate customers. Like you find out three months ago, you should have yeah. billed a customer for something. You got to go back to the customer and say, "Hey, do you mind paying this big bill?" That's never they're never happy. So there's all this yeah. there's all this mess, right? And I think that's what your your solution. Yeah. Oh, so talk a little bit about that. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it, it, it's interesting. I remember being an MSP and hearing statistics out there and being like. Maybe, but not not my MSP. Not me. I got my I got my <laughs> shit together, right? Um, but but when you look at it, the the MSPs that we're seeing on average is ten percent of their revenue, and I don't want to just say revenue, but it, like profit. Just they're not billing ten percent of what they're delivering to their clients. We've had an MSP that found twenty percent, right? So when you think about the opportunity of of how much revenue you're missing out on, just by you know the the complexity, the amount of tab we call it tab chaos between all your vendor partner portals, all of your different contracts and your PSA is going cross-eyed looking at everything. It's a pain in the ass. We just, we hated doing it. Um, back when I ran an MSP, people still hate doing it. It's not been solved. So um, so yeah, that's that's what we're out here doing is, is making sure that we eliminate that complexity. We make it go through easily that you're, you're not missing out on something because at the end of the day, you're already paying your partners and your vendor partners for all that consumption. It's out there being used. You're being billed for it. You're just not paying or getting paid for it from your clients. So finding the way to ease that experience. And a lot of MSPs you'll talk to, they confuse billing with invoicing is the other thing. And they think invoicing took me nine minutes and they're bragging about it in Facebook groups, which is great. Well, the PSAs were always able to do that, right? You click your checklists and your buttons and say, send that off to QuickBooks or Zero or whatever you're using. The invoicing is easy and quick. The actual billing and making sure that the amount that you're invoicing is correct is not. And so that's what we're, we're making sure is save all that time, focus that time elsewhere, get that money back in your pocket and stop taking it. Like you're giving so many freebies out to clients. Yeah. And we, and like the, if you look, okay, you say, what is an average MSP make in profitability, right? And yeah. so the average out there is they're making less than 10% net. And again, yeah. this is this is confusing because sometimes they take their salary and they think their salary is their net. So they're not making yeah. any net because they're taking it all on a salary or they are, um, you know, they're, they're, or sometimes they're going negative, you know? And so when you think about that and it, look, it's tough being an MSP, especially today because it's a hyper competitive market. You're constantly getting beat up on price. So, you know, you got to make sure you're, you can't just overprice and make it up and just charging more because then you won't win business. Technical talent, the costs are going up. Software costs are going up. Um, even gas, I mean, gas and rent, everything is going up in cost. Yeah. So now more than ever, I think it's critical that MSPs are billing properly for 
honest work, honest services that they're providing, that they're paying Mm -hmm. for, but they're just not properly invoicing the client. And so they're just, they're just losing and missing out, but it is a complicated problem. I mean, how long does it take the average MSP to really properly go through billing and make sure everything's correct? Yeah. It, it, like anything, it depends on the size of them. Right. But, but the, the research and stuff that we've done three to 10 hours on average is what people are spending doing this. Now, I would, I would challenge that a little bit because when I ran my MSP, this was before the SaaS full SaaS revolution and we were selling like maybe five, eight products that took us 16 hours to do across 35 clients, right? Like that took time. The average MSP has 20 to 30 solutions they're reselling in their stack today and passing through to clients with this whole advent and proliferation of different security categories, right? So it's taking a lot of time. They're not tracking the time and I don't blame them because I wouldn't want to know how much time I'm wasting doing something I absolutely hate. Um, So, but it is taking a a significant amount of time every month, generally from the top dog in the business because they want to make sure that they're getting paid. They want, it's one of those things that's hard to, to hand off to somebody else to do. So it's like, how valuable is that? CEO or president or whatever managing director, whatever your title is, how valuable is your time? But at the same time, how valuable is it to make sure that you're getting paid for everything? Yeah, it's like a catch 22. So how does your solution work exactly? Yeah, so we've taken um, a bit of a unique approach overall. But right now, you know, it's it's unique in the industry as well, because we're, we're full freemium type solutions. So we let MSPs experience the full solution at no cost. Coming in, trying it and experiencing it. And for the full free version, you have have complete access to a single screen visibility of all of your product lines, all of your billings, which also gives a, a level of, of understanding that an MSP has not had before. You know, raise your hand if you're watching this and you're the only person that's going to know, do you know what your revenue and profit per product line is in your business? My venture would say no, right? I would say you would know your per contract and you would know your overall, but not per product line. So we give all of that for free. And then if you can get a a CSV or a a vendor export as to your consumption, whether it's a CSV and Excel, what have you, you can just drag and drop those into our system and we pair things up and auto map things. So now all of a sudden you're just looking through and just have to make sure, yeah, this looks good. And it writes back to your PSA. All of that is free. That's completely free. Now, the difference that we're taking is is kind of that second reason that MSPs and the channel as a whole is struggling is the lack of integration in this industry. And that's that's no individual's fault. We're we're thriving as an industry. So more players are wanting to come in and do more things. And and that's the, the same is true in the PSA category. Vendors have stopped building a lot of integrations with PSAs as much as every MSP demands and and bags and bags for PSA integration because it's too big an R&D investment for the vendors to integrate with every PSA out there. So the approach that Gradient has taken is we've connected to all of those PSAs or the eight most popular ones now. And we have vendors that are integrating with this to solve that challenge for you so that you can get that integration you want and they can get it as well at a fraction of their effort and have that automatically pass through to whatever PSA you use. So Again, with that freemium model, you'll get your first integration for free of that pass through. And then afterwards, it's 99 bucks a month for unlimited integrations. So very simple to just get it set up. And whether you want it, set it, forget it. Whether you want to step in once a month, once a quarter and just review and approve things to true up, however you want to do it. But you shouldn't have to be downloading and logging into 20 to 30 partner portals and going through the monotony and just hellish fury of, of reviewing every line item on every contract. Yeah. I mean, that's a huge waste of time when you could be spending it. I mean, if you're a CEO, you got to be spending it on, you know, growing the company and more important things. Um, But even if you give it to an admin, an admin could still, there's human error and you're paying an admin, you know, even if you're, if you're paying an admin, um, you know, to do this work five hours, I mean, the, the cost of the, the software yeah. is cheaper than having an admin. Again, if you're going to pay an admin, have an admin yeah. doing list building or prospecting on LinkedIn or doing some posting on social media, getting you some leads and sales. So this is, I think this yeah. is really cool. So where would, if, if there's an MSP watching this and they want to test it out, you said there is a freemium model, so it's free. Yeah. 
Where, where would they, where would they go? What, where should they learn to learn more about this? Yes. Yeah, so you hop on to meetgradient.com. You'll see a whole bunch of flamingos and other colorful stuff on there. Just hit the get started button. And that's going to pop you right into the system, walk you through the process. You'll see it's a super easy onboarding and setup ready in minutes, and then give it a try. You can hear about every other testimonial. You can hear us harping about how easy and good it is. You got nothing to lose, but a few minutes of your time to to set it up, check it out and see if that works for you. Perfect. And it's free, right? I mean, the first, at least to to test it out and see if it's true. Okay. Well, Colin, this is great. I appreciate it. I think now more than ever, MSP has got to be very prudent with their time and their money. And they've got to make sure that they're, they're actually getting paid for the things that they're actually doing. Um, because we are living in, uh, you know, a great time for MSPs, but also just in general with inflation and costs going up, Mm -hmm. uh, everybody has to make sure they get every dollar in the door that they're entitled to. So, um, perfect. All right, everyone go check it out. Give that URL one more time. Meetgradient.com. All right. We'll put a link below the video. All right, folks. Thank you. And thank you, Colin. Perfect. Thanks.